Hello friends, good morning to all of you. Uh, today we will continue with some uh, UMTS or 3C interview questions and answers. Uh, so we will uh, basically focus on the channels today. So uh, the first question uh, for today uh, from where I am going to start is uh, uh, description of UMTS AI interface channel types and their functions. That is the question. Uh, so the answer for the UMTS channels and function is like there are three types of channels across AI interface physical channels, logical channels and transport channels. If you will go uh, you know physical layer then transport layer then logical channels. So physical channels transport and logical or if you go as uh, you know descending order it is logical then transport and physical channels. Physical channels uh, carries uh, data between physical layers of UE and OB. Transport channels uh, carries data between uh, physical layer and MAC layer and the logical channels carries data between MAC and the RRC layer. So that is all about the channels basic concept. The next question is uh, detailly explain what are the physical transport and logical channels available. So in logical channels we are having uh, control channels and traffic channels. So control channels are like uh, BCCH, broadcast control channel, pacing control channel, common control channel and dedicated control channels. Uh, in the traffic channel we are having dedicated traffic channel and common traffic channel. So these are the six uh, channels in logical channel again subdivided into trans, uh, you know control and uh, uh, traffic channels. I have already explained what are the control and what are the traffic channels. Then uh, what are the transport channels? So uh, the common control channels are like broadcast channel, uh, forward access channel, pacing channel, RACH random access channel and uh, CPCH. And uh, in dedicated channels we are having dedicated channel and uh, downlink uh, a sad channel. Then in physical channels we are having common control uh, channels, uh, primary common control physical channels, secondary common control physical channels, primary synchronization channel, secondary synchronization channel, common pilot channel, uh, acquisition indication channel, pacing indication channel, physical downlink shared channel, physical random access channel, physical uh, you know uh, common pilot channel and uh, all lot of channel in 3C. So all these are uh, you know physical channels. Then we are having CAICH or CD also, CDICH or CAICH. Uh, in dedicated uh, physical channels, we are having uh, uh, downlink physical uh, dedicated channel and uh, uh, downlink physical control channels. or you know dedicated physical data and control channels uh, that you call dedicated channels. So these are all the uh, channels and uh, in all, all layer physical layer, transport layer and uh, logical layer and I have already explained all the channels to you. The next question is uh, what are the RRC operation modes available in uh, 3G? So there are two modes one is idle mode one is connected mode. So in RRC uh, how many states we have like how many RRC modes are there. So uh, one is cell DCH, cell fetch, Eura PCH and uh, uh, cell PCH. So four state, four RRC state, cell DCH, cell fetch, Eura PCH and cell PCH. So these are the four uh, you know uh, RRC states available. Uh, what is Eura? So URA is the uh, U-Tran registration area. Uh, the next question for today is uh, what uh, transparent mode, acknowledgement mode and on acknowledgement mode. So transparent mode corresponds to the lowest uh, service of the RLC layer, radio link control layer. No controls and uh, no uh, detection of uh, missing data. Uh, we really don't know. It's it's a very transparent uh, transmission, so that's why it's called transparent mode. On acknowledgement mode offers uh, the possibility of uh, segment 
and uh, you know concatenate of data but no error correction or retransmission uh, therefore no guarantee of delivery also so that's why it's called on acknowledgement mode then we are having acknowledgement mode uh, which offers uh, um, you know acknowledgement of transmission flow control error correction and retransmission also so these are the three modes uh, used in uh, uh, rlc layer transparent mode and acknowledgement mode and acknowledgement mode uh, the next question for you is uh, which layers perform ciphering function very important so rlc for acknowledge mode am and on acknowledgement mode uh, mac for transparent mode so uh, both of them you know uh, perform the ciphering mode the ciphering function uh, then the next uh, question for you is what is obsf if if i'll go on uh, a full form of the definition it's orthogonal variable spreading factor o obsf uh, you know which is uh, we use obsf codes in 3z uh, so that's all about OV, obsf then how many obsf codes uh, spaces are available like what is the you know obsf code spaces so like uh, total obsf code is 256 reserved one uh, for spreading factor 64 for secondary common control uh, you know um, physical channels uh, one uh, for uh, spreading factor 256 for common pilot channel then um, uh, you know one for primary common control uh, physical channel and uh, you know pacing indication channel and acquisition indication channel also uh, so total available uh, out you know we have this four reserved codes so 256 minus 4 is 248 which is available uh, in the next session we'll come with some more questions and answers keep watching take care bye bye